the Altrium Electric Railway Preservation Society have been restoring their MSJ and AR coach number 117 over many years at the Midland Railway Trust. This is one of two vehicles owned by the organisation and it dates from 1931, forming a centre trailer car from the 1500 volt DC era of operations on the Manchester Altrium line. In 2021, after 50 years of ownership, car 117 has received a coat of authentic paint and was externally ready to come out of the paint shops at Butterley to be seen in the open for the first time in many years. The coach also now displays the original operating company's crest. To move the coach, access to the paint shop had to be gained and this involved shunting a number of vehicles off the approach roads to the shed. 1957 built, former Castle Donington Power Station No. 4 was used for the first stage of this move. Derby built, Class 11 diesel 12077 provided additional help in facilitating the move. With the DMU stock out of the way, the Barclay returned to the paint shop road to collect MSJ 117. And so 117 emerges into the daylight for the first time in many years. The whole process would also enable an historic steam age survivor to be moved ready to go off site. Class 11 now collects the MSJ car and sets off past Butterley Box for Swanwick, where a place in the Midland Railway Trust's museum is being prepared. And at the museum, we find the subject of the other part of this move, the National Railway Museum's Midland Railway Kirkley locomotive. It's a zigzag approach to get the coach in, and the Barclay once again couples up to take the AERPS coach back off the junction onto the Swanwick sidings and ultimately the museum roads. The diesel shunter, 12077, was built in 1950 as part of a batch of Class 11s built between 1945 and 1952. The 
Kirtley engine is somewhat older though, built 1866, with two inside cylinders and it's one of 29 built in her class. Number 158A, a sole survivor, once hauled express trains over the Midland Railway and acquired the letter A after a rebuild. Over the years the engine has been rebuilt and altered several times but remains the oldest surviving Midland Railway locomotive. Number 158A was preserved after withdrawal in July 1947. This classic locomotive is eased carefully from the exhibition shed. Recent work on the locomotive featured the removal of boiler cladding asbestos. Today, 158A will change places with the MSJ coach and will be collected for transfer from Butley to the NRM's Locomotion Museum, where it will be prepared and restored externally for exhibition. In its day, 158A, designed by Matthew Kirtley, would have hauled crack expresses in and out of London's King's Cross station. With the Midland Kirtley locomotive clear of the museum, it was time for MSJ car 117 to be propelled into its new home. The next stage of the Altrium Society's work will be to find sponsors so that the interior compartments can be restored to their original condition. And then there is the ARPS Coach 121 to start on. Back at Butterley, the Kirtley looks the part, despite being minus boiler cladding, as the shunters move the locomotive off the main line and into the shed prior to collection by road transport. Many an enthusiast dreams of seeing this wonderful steam locomotive restored to full operational condition. Maybe one day? And the AERPS dream too of seeing their recently restored Coach 117 joined by 121 in an operational state. If you would like to know more about the next challenge the AERPS face with the projected restoration of 121, there is a further video with details. And if you can assist the AERPS with the sponsorship of any part of their work on these two historic MSJ and AR coaches, then the following address can be used for donations and membership subscriptions. 
Your support will be very much appreciated and thanks for watching.